Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Helinda T and thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, it is Christmas Eve. The day that I have had, I can't even tell y'all. But I did check into the Sunder. Um, this is not the same place that I was at last year for New for Christmas. Um, I booked a different part of the city for for my life to get here. It's raining. <sighs> when I, you know, the room is nice. You guys saw like the room tour. It's nice, but it's not what I saw when I booked the room. It's there's a lot of stuff missing than when I um, booked the room. So I just, I was very flustered. I was a little, I was quite frustrated um, when I, you know, walked in and I saw like, there's so many stuff, that, there's so much stuff that's not here that was supposed to be here. You know, like the lamps and this is all stuff that I'm like, okay, cool, I'm gonna need all of this. There's no cutlery, there's no glass. Like, I know it's small stuff, but I need it because I had planned so much for all this. But anyway, I don't want to sound like I'm fussing because I feel like I'm fussing right now. But we're here. So anyway, it is the 24th. I am starving. I want to get some food first before I do anything. I need to order food because I'm so hungry. I literally have not eaten the entire day. I woke up. I edited my vlog. I had to... I had to clean, I had to pack. I was just doing so much stuff that I never ate. Yeah, we're gonna celebrate, we're gonna have a good time. At least I got my wine. I have my wine. I'll be fine. Come on. But anyway, I wanted to welcome the vlog. Guys, it is Christmas. And let's have a good time. Let's just relax, be merry, and have a really good time. I'm wearing this jumpsuit. But it's okay. We're gonna have a great time. We are gonna have a great time. Because we have to have a great time. Okay. Hey, friends. I am trying to add my own little touches to the place to make it feel not as big as, you know, I was able to get the fireplace. YouTube, love that. And then I just added my laptop and I put my, my perfume, my Polaroid, my bag, and I had this blanket. You guys know I go everywhere with this blanket. I never travel without it. And I have some of the stuff that I had um, set up. And then at least I can make some hot chocolate, so I set up, I have apple cider, I've got my tea, my rooibos tea. This is actually so good, it's from Whole Foods. So, really, and I ordered food, thank goodness, we do have food coming. I'm so hungry, I can eat at Arby. <laughs> I don't know why that song keeps playing in my head, but I ended up, because on Uber Eats, I saw this video on TikTok that was like, a lot of the places on Uber Eats is the same restaurant, they just add a different name. So you can, it can be like a restaurant you've never heard of, but if you search the location, it's actually a restaurant that's like, just uses a thousand different names. So I had to do what I had to deal with what I could and I got my McDonald's. Yay! <sighs> McDonald's it is. I just got some um what's this thing called? I got what's the, uh, the only thing I eat at McDonald's is what are they called? The nuggets. I got nuggets, fries, and a cream, because that's literally the only thing I eat from McDonald's. So what I want to do now is before the food comes. I want to unpack some of my clothes a little bit, just so I can feel more, you know, relaxed. But I'm going to watch in the meantime. What is this? When did that happen? happened but we are gonna go with it 
because I'm not in the mood right now. But my current, I want to tell you guys, my current obsession right now is what's this thing called? This scandal, the fix up in South Africa. Scandal, Olivia Pope. Olivia Pope. Listen, Shonda Rhimes, when she made scandal, she ate fits. My God. Fitz is just such a man. He's just such a man. He's so fine. That's my type. Fitz is my type. But anyway, um, I'm literally gonna put on some scandal now with my food. I cannot wait until it gets here. Is this not just the cutest thing? I feel like I'm really like this is a real fireplace. And on a nice big TV, let's see with the lights off. I wanna show you guys the lights off. Oh tell me that it's just not the move. Go on YouTube and search. This light is actually amazing. And just search like fireplace. They have ones that play jazz as well. <laughs> search this on YouTube. Just search like fireplace burning. And date night. Okay. to crying like too close if you guys just saw the clip before this then you'll know that I was in a car because who decided to close the restaurant early and not tell anyone McDonald's and I said Elena it's up to you now what happens next is up to you whether you have dinner or not is up to you babes and i said one thing i'm gonna do tonight is have dinner so called up the uber and i was like i'm praying because i was searching for this one place that i know that has chicken so we got chicken and as we're walking up i was just praying i was like lord please let this place be open because it wasn't like I didn't know what was open or what was closed anymore. But I got my food. This is my first meal of the day. McDonald's they they it was order cancelled, order coming, order cancelled, order coming. Yeah. I almost cried. This is my night shower because one thing about me when i'm in a hotel i will get every shower out of my nice hotel shower so i just took a really nice shower <laughs> and i just want to do some skincare so i use the um no. the inky list fulvic acid brightening cleanser um I think the only thing, I definitely fell asleep. And it's so funny because I literally see resemblance of everything that happened last year um, on Christmas happening now. And I just think it's so interesting. I really do think it is just the most interesting thing ever. But so far, so good. I definitely know that it was after I ate 
that I kind of went <laughs> and my body was like okay we're good now we can act like normal human beings again you know so all of that and then I'm just trying to I'm really trying to think of what I'm going to do tomorrow because I really I want to go out for dinner everywhere is fully booked ah nice everywhere is fully booked I have reservations at this one place I don't know if I want to go there I have reservations at this one place. I don't really, I'm not sure if I want to go there. So what I do want to do like now is like look for somewhere else that's open and has a table. The thing is that almost everywhere is booked. So the problem with Christmas restaurants is that um, you really have to book a lot in advance and I just never thought about that i was more focused on just finding the hotel that i'm going to be in than um thinking about where i'm going to go for dinner so that's something that we have to it's not, it doesn't really matter where i stay where i go eat i would like for it to be somewhere nice but you know whatever's available will be just fine I go in with the Ren skincare. Um, this is the Ready Steady Glow Daily AHA Tonic. AHA Tonic. Um, this is the toner that I use. And this is how I do it. I'm probably just going to make like my family calls now. And call everyone from back home. I've just been playing my jazz since I woke up. Um, what I do is I just kind of soak the tissue pad in the toner, just like that, and then <laughs> um, just cleanse all the extra dirt off my face because. And I, I only added this toner not too long ago into my routine. And I was like, I really feel like my face is not as clean as it should be after using, uh, like after washing my face, especially when I was wearing makeup. I was always like, I don't know, man. I just feel like my skin could be a lot cleaner. And once I started using toner, even when I'm not wearing like makeup and stuff I see like all the extra crap that comes off my face so I would definitely recommend if you are looking into like your skincare get a toner get a toner just so that you can make sure that your face is really clean and I want to show you guys everything that came off my face now I remember I wasn't wearing no makeup none You can see it on the camera now, but it's so quiet. Oh my gosh. But dirt definitely came out. So, because I already brushed my teeth, I'm just gonna wait for like two minutes for the toner to soak in. Then I'm gonna apply just my moisturizer. My skincare routine is very simple, I don't do a whole lot of my skin, but. I go in with the ordinary, this is the natural moisturizer. And then I go in with this once my toner has set in. Typically, I'll put on the toner and then brush my teeth because I just want the toner to like dry properly. So yeah.
restaurants that I can um, go to tonight because the one that I had a reservation for I don't know man something's just telling me that I shouldn't go there so I might just go to another place that I found but we'll see it's only like 12 30 now so I only went I properly went to bed at 8 that's when I really went to bed and then what else happened nothing I just woke up and I was on the phone so I just made some tea. I really just want to take it easy today. Just relax, like just, you know, I, I even thought I was gonna go to like a jazz bar later on today. But then I'm like, no, I just want, I can always go to a jazz bar, but how often do I book myself into a, into a hotel? So I just want to come, I want to go have dinner for sure, come back, and just like relax just enjoy my time as i was on the phone this morning um i hear a knock on the door and i'm like who's knocking on the door who is knocking on the door yesterday i had asked the hotel if they can bring me um just like cutlery because i didn't have any cutlery and this morning they bought me glasses they bought me cutlery they bought me plates and i was like that is so cute i don't know if you guys can see but that's like the cutlery and the plates and the glasses so i was like that is so sweet but yeah so my plan for today is literally relax not stress myself with anything too much enjoy my time out and enjoy my christmas because why not I don't even know what I'm gonna have for breakfast. What should I have for breakfast? I feel like I really want eggs. So I had some fruit that I brought and I have my tea. That's what I'm gonna have for breakfast. Super simple. And I can't complain. <laughs> This is my only time when I allow myself to do this, like just sleeping. So I decided that I'm gonna go and I'm gonna get some lunch. There's this restaurant that I really like. I went the one time. Um, it's called The Will and the Way. Uh, so I wanna just go grab some lunch from them. They're having like a special Christmas um, Asian cuisine menu. So I wanna go see what their food is and grab some lunch come back and then my goal actually was to do a get ready with me so while i'm doing my makeup because i do still want to go out for dinner because it's christmas and you have to spoil yourself on christmas ah the soak my you have to spoil yourself on christmas so i'm literally sparing myself no cost and the nice thing is that the will in the way is like a block away from here two blocks at most so it's really close
it's really close so I'm able to just kind of walk over and then come back um, and then come back I want to watch a movie I've just been watching Scandal and I'm like girl you need to watch something else other than Scandal so I want to there's a movie that I saw was highly recommended so I want to come back and watch that but I just wanted to give you guys a quick update about how the day is going I've really been on the phone with family for a very long time today so that's been really nice um this is my second Christmas alone I must say you you start to feel like you know a bit because you're like okay I know what it's about I know what this is gonna give so last year and this year is there any difference I'm good the only I wanted to show you guys as well the difference in the morning is that I go in with the Good Molecules Niacinamide Serum after I wash my face. Remember last night I used the toner? So in the morning, 4 p.m. in the morning, I used the, um, the Niacinamide. And Good Molecules is always going to be one of my favorite skincare brands. I love a lot of their products. The ones that I've tried have all just been so good. Also, y'all, sheen bags make for really great travel bags. Like, really good. I have my little, my face care in the one, and then, because I couldn't find bags yesterday to put my stuff in. I have my face care in the one bag, and then I have, um, like, my body lotions and all that, like, my soaps and stuff in another. I have a makeup bag, so my makeup's in a separate thing but these are really good repurpose your stuff but anyway um yeah and then pretty much um i go in with the moisturizer and then the last step in my morning routine is the black girl sunscreen um just the regular black girl sunscreen so and it's not only for black girls it just doesn't leave a white cast but honestly one of my favorite um sunscreens that and the la roche posay top tier absolutely top tier but let me not bore you guys too much i'll probably see you once i've done my minimal makeup and i'm ready to head out so i'll chat to y'all soon i want to pick up this music and just vibe out so yeah i'm gonna see y'all soon Bye. put on something a little bit warm as well you can't even see me well that's the face for today. Well, for now. I'm just gonna get lunch now. I just wanna get something a little cozy. Let's head out. I'm just gonna pop one. Let's go. I just realized that I never tell you guys what scent I'm wearing, and I took the light off now, so that's why it's a bit darker. But this is the Anna Adia. I love my Arabian perfumes. This is the one that I'm wearing right now. But. This is really, really, really nice. Trust me, I love this. But the first one that I bought from this brand, which is the white one, oh, chef's kiss. This is a dupe of Baccarat. So if you're looking for something that smells very similar to Baccarat, I'll have the link um, in the description, bio, whatever it's called. <laughs> I'll link this. And then I'm gonna do a whole um, review of all the Arabian perfumes that I've got. But this is my scent of the day. I already sprayed some, but there's one more. Swear it's gonna hurt. That's it. Oh, I will wait for you. I will wait for you.
place that I wanted to go to, the food just wasn't giving. This is why I always say that it's... This is why I love exploring downtown because instantly I was like, okay, what's another restaurant that I know? And then I remember that I was always walking past this one restaurant. And I was like, I want to come here one day. Luckily, they're open. And I was able to come and I got my appetizer and I went to go home. Well, go to the hotel. And then um, have it there. I don't want to get something big because I don't want to buy something. I'm going to go out for dinner. So, this is why exploring is so good. You just end up knowing things. talking about it's called the swimmer i saw a lot of people talking about that um so yeah i'm gonna mix this up i wish i had a um i love artichokes spinach and artichoke dip is always so good and this one is topped with feta so Thank goodness they gave me plates. Um, because I hate eating in things like this. I hate paper plates. I hate not eating on a plate. But this is the perfect amount, the perfect size. That the will in the way place was quite disappointing. Um the dumplings were pork, so I couldn't eat that. And then, I don't know, so there was something with the vegetable rolls that I just wasn't feeling as well. So I just kind of walked out. I'm gonna hop right into bed. And then, yeah. We're ready to, we're ready, we're ready to head out. Um, I just did like a quick get ready with me. A little tipsy talk actually, because I was on my one. But it was like a little tipsy talk, so I'm gonna edit that. But I'm late now, I hope the kitchen isn't closed. I don't even know what I want. But um, I'm literally gonna call the lift now. You guys know me and my poncho, I love my poncho. So I'm gonna head out. We're gonna go to the polo club and we're just gonna enjoy a little bit of a piano player read our book maybe get some food i'm not hungry that food really filled me up so i don't know if i want to get something and have for breakfast tomorrow what should we do decisions 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 you little, you little. Staying longer, but it's okay. We will come back. 
rest of the night is probably just gonna be very much a relax and just enjoy the rest of my Christmas um, just take some time I definitely need to shower and get all the makeup off and I think that's really what pushed me to go because I said like I've already done all this makeup I might as well just go so I went but it's okay Definitely like the scandal vacation. I have just done so much. I've watched a lot of scandal, so I'm not mad. You're gonna want to see this, son. You're located. Good morning, friends. Good morning. Good morning, y'all. Definitely fell asleep yesterday. Definitely fell asleep. I um I don't even know what happened, but I got into I was like I was eating, nail came off, child. I was eating, and then the last thing I remember was just um I don't know, watching some scandal, and then boom, 6 a.m. Don't ask me how it happened. I don't know, but it happened. So I woke up at 6 and then I check out today at 11. So I just said to myself, you know what? I'd rather wake up because I wanted to shower. So I'd rather wake up, shower, get all of that done properly, pack my stuff, pack everything, and then um, have like extra time. So now that it's only 8.50 and I'm basically done with everything i don't have anything else to do so love that for me <laughs> i literally just want to make some tea i'm really hungry i just want to make some tea and um i don't know i might put on a movie or something so today's the last day and i'm really 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 sad but it's okay i always love when i just like, treat myself to things like this it's been quite a fun 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 Christmas staycation. I don't even know if this is the end of the vlog, but if it is, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little Christmas adventure that we went on over this staycation. <laughs> and 2024, we're coming for you. We're ready. And I'm just super excited for everything that's to come in the new year. So, and I hope you are too. And I'm sending all my love and blessings to y'all. Don't forget to like, comment your favorite part of the video, share, and most importantly, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Mwah. Sending my loving kisses, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.